Hey guys, and welcome back to Satisfactory, where we are, uh, well, I'm finishing off what we, what we started in many, many episodes ago. Let's put it that way. What the heck? By... No. I do wish that... So you know how the, the tool belt, or rather the hotkeys, I know the tool belt is used for like actually swapping between tools in this game, but the uh, the hotkeys. I wish we could have multiple layers of those, so that depending on what I was doing, I could uh, be doing different shit. Almost there. Come on. Hey, there we go. I love the way it just throws the metal and the, the stuff up. That is such a cool, uh, such a cool interaction. Uh, I think it's stored right. No, it's not store left. How much did I miss? Uh, just a couple of. Missing one more at the top. Are we? Uh, I can't really tell. I'll go up there and sort out any that we uh, we happen to have missed. This is a fecking monolith. Alright, we're gonna need more concrete and probably some more steel plate or metal plates, iron plates. But yes, this is an absolute beast, man. We go through a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of this shit. All right, I think this and here is the iron plates. No, you twat! Fucking misclick. All right. So yeah, we made we made all of this beautiful modular system, and then it turns out we could probably make most of it a lot smaller now that the uh, the belt elevators have been added. Are you fucking kidding me, Stejo? What? You're an actual idiot. It's not a massive deal, <laughs> but come on, the fucking wall conveyor in the wrong way. Hello? There we go. I was like, am I just not allowed to... No, don't do this to me. Don't do me dirt. Oh, it's not. It's not. It's not doing me dirty. Interesting. Is that is that where I was going wrong? Do I need to now point at, like, the centre? It's not the, the actual entrance? Interesting. I wonder. I wonder. Alright. Invalid aim location. Right, let's get up the top and we'll see what we can uh, we'll see what we can build while we're up there. And then we should be good to go. Then what we're going to do is we're going to get the the output hooked up with the belt elevators and get that on the go. I'll actually check to see how expensive that is. I also wonder if we can use that for like Stigio elevators. I wonder. 
instead of me having to run up. Hmm. Uh. There we go. Right, let's drop the the roof on this. I don't know why I never done the the roof. On. Oh, it's because I used to jump into the jump into the top, wasn't it? Uh, wrong wall. This wall. Good built. Oh no, I didn't. Okay. Where I go? I am just waiting on the day that that thing fucking just knocks me right off of something super dodgy. <laughs> I mean, it wouldn't be a massive bollock, it just wouldn't be great. Right. There we go. And let's drop these on. Sweet. Okay, now what I need to do is... I really need to keep enough stuff in to, like, I, I need to keep the, the 200 biomass. That's really cool that you can mouse over it and see what you can use it for. Uh, yeah, I need to keep the 200 biomass on me at all times so that I can... Always make something to land on. Okay, that's gonna hurt. Mm, not as sore as you expect. Okay, now we need to work on the belt elevators to get the stuff down. I wonder if they require power. Interesting. Caffeinating. Uh, right. Let's remove this. How much did we get? Quite a bit. Uh, geez, it's really hard to do anything when it's so bloody dark. Right, let's see how these actually work then. So, a Mark III belt lift. What do they cost? Uh, just a lot of the, the same thing that regular belts cost. You're dead as soon as the... Uh, as soon as my stuff is researched, my sulfur. Oh, actually, my sulfur will be researched. Remove that. Anything else dodgy? Right, let's go and let's go and get the uh, the sulfur research done then, and then we can swap over and get the quartz research done, and then we can swap over and get some of the other junk research as well. Oh, excuse me. Uh, sulfur as analysisized. Percentage of sulfur. Ooh. Milestone found in tier four. Oh, nice. Further research required for more precise use. Nobelisk detonator. And a nobelisk. Can be used with a nobelisk detonator to blow up cracked boulders, vegetation, other vulnerable targets. Ah. Right, this is cool. Although we are we're trying to get the jetpack just now. But no, that's really cool. And then we can research the nobelisk to get some more stuff. And I feel like that's where we are going to be getting some of the interesting junk from. Uh, and we can research mycelia again. But let's toss the quartz in for now. And I'll try and remember at the start of the next episode to... How long have we got? We've got 10 minutes. Okay, so 5 minutes at the next episode. We need to check that. Alright, but let's, uh, let's try and work out how these uh, elevators actually work. Do they, do they just go up one, or are they like, the, the thingy where, oh, oh, holy 
Holy shit. That is awesome. Uh, so, the way this needs to be is we need a merger in front of... Yeah, so this wasn't... Ah, okay, so basically I need to just... Alright, I found out how to work these. Okay. Uh, they definitely have changed them, but... Okay. So now I, like, I need that. To go there. They look so fucking sick! Oh my god. I am so proud of this community. <laughs> fucking memes. Uh no, that's that's super fucking cool. Like legit, that is incredibly awesome. Hmm. Okay. I think you are... you're just too low. I think it's there that you need to be? Can I just like... no I can't fit a foundation there. Okay, what I need to do is... don't... don't put them there. I need this fucking jetpack, man. Like, legit need this jetpack to do some of this junk. That's the thing, I said I was going to make the jetpack before I started doing all of this crap. Because of how long it would take. Ugh. Do I want to get the jetpack? I need 150 of those... ...motors. Is it worth just building the fucking motors and stuff? No, because I need the supercomputers, which is the, the entire oil situation, so no, let's not do that. Alright, let's just be relatively annoyed by the fact that I need to run up these ladders all the time. I think, what's the... What is the ideal way to do this? Is it to... To do it like this. Okay, and then the top one. Sweet. And then we'll start to delete all this shit. Only when it's no longer needed, and I'm not currently standing on it, because that would be bad. Oh, I'm getting rid of my space elevator. My space elevator. It dingleberry. Right, so the way we do is we come up to the tippy top. Alright. This isn't the tippy top, this is a roofy whiff. I don't need to be on the roofy whiff. Yay! Uh, conveyor merger. Right, and the way it works is you start with... No, it needs to be... Okay. Boop. Uh, and then we get a merger here. And it needs to go that way. I think it. There we go. We need to be at least one away. Uh, no, you can be a regular conveyor belt. Okay, you're orange, you're orange, and you should be blue. Yes. 
Okay, so that needs to go... Like that. Wait, that does work, even though it's like not sucked in right. Is that better? Is that too high? It's too high this time. It's very difficult to tell when you're like below it. Is that it? No, it's too fucking low! It made the noise. Okay, so the click noise means that it's it's bang on. Okay, so we're getting iron rod coming in. Okay, so All right, no, that's wrong. All right, regular conveyor belt. Oh fucking shit, my! <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, that's a uh, a blue, and that's a uh, no. Okay, fucked up. Uh, I need blue on that side now. Okay, <sighs> sorry, my fucking heart's still going after that nonsense that just went, that just uh, transpired. There we go. <laughs> Nearly fell off. Okay, and that's the, the output there. So now the... The merger here needs the output on. On that side. Right. Right, and that's the blue on that side. Sweet! Look at this! Look how fast this is in comparison to the stupid fucking other things that we were doing. Don't get me wrong, like, for the, the section of the game that we were in, the... For the shit that we could do before, that was, that was perfect. But now... Not so much. I mean, the other thing as well is, uh, aesthetically, ain't much worse. Like, look at how cool this looks. I'm still trying to see, like, I'm still trying to work out, have they made it easier? To uh, to hook up these conveyor belts, these uh, these mergers and stuff. Now that I've figured out how you actually bloody do it. Right now, that's coming out this way, and we do that and drop it there. Look at that! How cool does that look? Why the fuck are those ones coloured differently to the rest of them? That's weird. <laughs> anyway, yeah, how cool does that look? That is actually, like, epic. I do not have enough slots for this. Organization. Ah, the industrial storage now has uh, two inputs and two outputs, which is epic. Ah. Uh, right, can I get all of them tossing out? Right. Okay, now we need... Storage container there. Uh, do, 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 do. Here we go, logistics. Bound to hotbar. 
Oh, I need iron rod. <laughs> I got rid of it all. No! Alright, and can I get... Yeah, Mark 3 into there. There we go. Alright. Oh, shit. I need to do this before it fills up. Alright, and could I get a double stack? Sweet! Right. We now have our full Mark III belt of iron rod now, which is pretty damn cool. Yay! Well chuffed. That'll fill up in absolutely no bloody time. But unfortunately, guys, that's all we've got time for in this episode. So as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Steve, you've been awesome, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.